So in the last video we have determined how veggies are not good. They just get stuck. This one was the best out of those three. But guess what? I picked out something else. You see this one not as wide. Let's see which one is better. But this one is way longer. If you look at it, let's put it this way. It's few, like maybe an inch longer. But it is not as wide. So, and also this is still super light. Look at that. It is very light. Compared to this one, you can just feel the heaviness. And this one even heavier. $19 versus $50. It's so light. It's really cool. So we're gonna put them to the test on a log like that. Big rounds. And see which one the best. Let's see if it goes through. Just nothing. It's like hitting the wall. Like, I'm gonna be hitting here all day. With this kind of halves, I feel like once we get it in quarters, it's liftable. I can either split it with the log splitter or with the mole once it's cut off a little bit. Okay, first of all, we're gonna go with this red one. Let's see how it does. What I like to do is just kind of start it like this. And I do it a little bit below middle. I don't know if this is the best way to do it, but let's see. Put it in all the way. Nice. A whole bunch of hits. We got it. This is a big round. Maybe help it out right here. Nice. Okay, and this is manageable pieces to where we can lift it up onto a log splitter or chop it with the actual axe. But I feel like that was a lot of hits. Look, this one is even bigger log. Let's test it with it. Yeah, there is no way. Look at that, it just bounced off. And it's even bigger. Let's try this one out. Start it out a little bit. Might as well get it deep. This is how it's held up on the side because it's so thin. I missed it a few times and it's as you can see, just shaping quite a bit. All right, let's see what this one does. Three, four. It's kind of going in faster. Wow. That's so much faster. It went through this log insanely easy. We'll do a couple more tests with that red one. I'm going to do one more time with the blue one. Drive it in really good so it doesn't fly out. Let's count the hits. One, two, three. Definitely missed a couple of times, my fault. But it already cracked. That's awesome. All right, let's do red one again. So splitting wedges, that's what they use for. You just help yourself out. Wow, it doesn't even want to drive in into here. What's happening? Let's see if the other one goes in easier. Can't even start this one. Let's see. You see? This one goes in super easy. What about this one? Not so much, so I'm gonna go with the same hole. So that's why that blue wedge is so much better. I use the blue wedge hold, still doesn't come in. And one more time, different spot on this one. Couple hits, you keep on going. Again, this one doesn't even wanna go in into this log. Two, three, four. Wow. I mean, seriously. I think we have figured it out. This one is way better. It's wider. 
a sharp edge or something it just goes in easier when you start it and also splits easier maybe because it's a little wider and it has the flaps this one is longer but not as wider and don't have a flaps this one it looks like a round so it will be easier to heat it over here because it has the widest uh, surf surface side here on the bottom but on the top but this one also just like a regular one and it has a little like swirl so kind of cool let's try it out this is a little sharp at the edge so it just goes in really easily and stays there so i can just drive it in a couple of inches so when i hit it hard it doesn't fly back at me all right i'm happy with that one two three four five six seven nice all right this one is all twisted up nice we got it this thing is incredibly light i hit it with the next one time but it's so light it feels like it's aluminum but i don't know what it's made from steel obviously they're a really good company so there is a clock there is a clock and there is a clock natural one so we're gonna help ourselves out by picking the biggest clock drive it in a little bit a couple of inches that's what i do so they don't fly out or go sideways and we're gonna finish it off level myself up Three, already well, come up. And we finished it. It's a really big, big round. So, boom. Amazing. So this is would be the best splitting wedge. Because it does the job like a blue one. Except this one is like three times or four times lighter. Not exactly know how much it weighs, but this is awesome. It's so light. So yeah, very heavy, very light. That's the difference. But these two splits them the best. These two are so far the best. But again, because this one is so much lighter, that's a winner. If you don't care about the weight and this one is cheaper, 